Hey guys, we're back with another episode of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic, ep uh, Chapter 2, or Knights of the Old Republic 2, Sith Lords, and we are going to be doing some things, so, uh, welcome back, uh, it is a pleasure, I uh, hope you guys are enjoying the series as much as I am, I love this game, uh, we're having a great time playing it, and uh, let's take a look at our uh, quest here, so, uh, we have to go to Doc Module 126. That's right, we went there last episode, and then uh, <laughs> the Athorians got attacked. So we had to come back and rescue them, which we did because we are awesome. So now we're going to the Doc Module 126. Uh, I'm really excited to, to play this game again as Dark Side because this planet here is completely different uh, when you do when you do it Dark Side. Um, I don't really remember how it goes when you play it dark side, but it is like completely different. So here's the Athorian. I don't know, did we go to Bay 1? Did we do anything in Bay 1? There's some TSF action going on here. This dock is off limits pending an ongoing TSF uh, investigation. It is pending an investigation. Okay, so we can't do anything in dock 1. So let's go back to dock number 2. That is, I believe, where we need to go. I think if we go over here, the droids are over here, I think. Well, yeah, the droids are over here. <laughs> These droids from the Zirka. Uh, what do you mean, what am I looking at? Hey, it's not my fault they built you no taller than a refresher bowl. <laughs> and then here's B4-D4. Greetings, you surprised me. Uh, what are you doing here? My companion and I are awaiting a ship. A ship to where? Nar Shaddaa, I believe. It oh, was God. the easiest destination for us to book passage to. You're going to stow away? Yes, if you insist on putting it that way. I would prefer to leave Citadel legally, though that option is currently unavailable to me. Oh my gosh. Um, should I do this? Should I take him to the TSF station? Nah, let's, let's just leave him alone. He helped us out, so let's just do what we need to do. Greetings. Uh, Chodo Habat sent me. I'm to take an orbital shuttle to RZ0031 on Telos. Yes, he said we're done. Please enter. The shuttle has been prepared and is ready for departure. Oh, thank you. I do appreciate that. Anything in these lockers that I can have? No, nothing in the lockers. Okay. All right, let's take a look around. Maybe we can find something here. You know, you never know. Let me switch weapons to my plasma torch. Okay, there we go. We're in. We are in the bay control. Anything in here that I need? No, nothing in here that I need. Okay. Hi, buddy. I shouldn't be here. I must devote my full attention to the operation of the docking bay. I'll be going now. Well, what the hell's the point of that? It's dumb. And there were no, like, goodies or anything in there? Weak. That's weak sauce. Uh, anything? Any crates or anything? What's in here? Is this a door? Storage. Nice. Nice. Anything that I can get? Ooh, I can get. Um, at and you're up. Just say the word. Word. Open sesame. Container's empty. <laughs> Did it say that it was empty and then I tried to unlock it? Oh my god, I'm the worst. I hear you. You hear me, Kraya? You hear me? Uh, I don't see any other containers or anything. So I think that we'll just have to board the ship. Yeah, I don't see any other containers, so let's go ahead and uh, board it. The orbital shuttle is used to transport cargo and passengers between Citadel Station and Telos surface. Take the freighter to Restoration Zone 0031. All right, here we go. This is Admiral Seed of the Sojourn. Welcome to Telos, Admiral. This is Lieutenant Grant of the Telos Security Force. We've been expecting you for some time now. We were unavoidably detained on our way here. I hope it hasn't caused too large of a problem. Only a minor inconvenience, Admiral. We were happy to be of assistance. I think you'll be less happy when you hear what I have to say next, Admiral. What is it? A witness from the Paragus incident escaped the station. 
We're not sure how she managed it, but we're currently trying to recover her. I see. Don't concern yourself with it too much, Lieutenant. The Republic had decided to not detain the Exile anyways. The Exile? Then... However, I expect that these security failings will be seen to and fixed, Lieutenant. We're on them right now, Admiral. I'm uploading your approach vector to you now. Gren out. Also, he didn't know I was a Jedi. But I am a Jedi. I just tell people I'm not. Alright, so we are making our way to the surface of Telos. Um, so I got some, some uh, feedback that the cutscenes were not... We don't see the cutscenes. Uh, if that's true, comment down below. Uh-oh. We're getting shot at. Uh, we are getting shot at by something. And we are hit. We are hit hard. And we are crashing. Oh, man, we're crashing on the surface. Oh, jeez. Oh, we crashed on the surface. I don't think we got where we needed to go. Oh no, we are like laid out. I got my swords though. I'm good. Good to have you back, General. General? Uh, where am I? Easy now. You survived one spectacular crash. Lucky I was here to pull you and your friends out of that shuttle, or you'd be more than a little crispy. But it's only fair. I owe you more than one, General. Uh, General? You must be in shock from the crash. Have to expect some long-term memory loss from that. Too bad she's not a droid, huh? <laughs> we can't all be that lucky. I'll humor you, General. I was one of the Iridonian Mechanic Corps that was at Malachor. Vader. I can see how you'd forget me, being that I was the only one. <laughs> I think I might recall you. Don't think too hard. I'd rather not talk about the war, if we could. We all went through some tough times after Malachor, and maybe we all did a little forgetting. Guess that's one thing we've got better than droids. They can't forget anything. But then you give them a memory wipe and they forget for good. How are the others? They'll be fine. The pilot's more or less unharmed, and the old lady, well, she's tougher than she looks. You know, I never thought I'd see you again, General. Galaxy's a big place. And this is the last place I thought I'd bump into you. So I have to ask, just what are you doing here? Uh, I was told I might be able to find my ship here. Well, if your ship's in as bad shape as this one, I don't think you're gonna have much luck. <clears throat> well, this is familiar. Feels like my last time on Telos. <laughs> Crashed the shuttle that time too? Nope, Pazak. That was not the most pleasant <laughs> landing I've endured. Next time we should perhaps seek out a more reputable pilot. You're welcome, Kreia. You know, if I weren't such a crack pilot, we could have hit the shield wall or one of those rock faces. Yes, our current situation is a vast improvement. <laughs> um, what shot us down? Beats me. No one's supposed to be here but a Zerka research team. I can't say they'd be happy to see us, but shooting us down? I can't imagine Zerka having a shot down by a bunch of scientists either. You know, I caught a glimpse of what looked like an AD tower when we flew over the compound. Why would a research station have an air defense tower? Maybe they're doing something they shouldn't be. I've seen pirate bases with the same sort of setup. Alright, let's go. We need to find our ship. I can help you find it. I have access to the shield network. Dope. I'm hoping to repair whatever damage your shuttle took, but not even I can fix that wreck. Okay. So what do we do? We'll have to get back to the compound. It's the old Athorian research station, turned into a salvage team staging area. It won't be an easy hike. Why not? First, there's a mercenary pursuit team looking for me. Mm. If Zerka secure the compound, there could be a lot of them out there. Second, there's all the Canucks. Canucks? What's a Canuck? The vicious wide jaw predators the Athorians imported from Duxon. They were meant to keep the herbivore population in check. I don't see any herbivores around. Right. The Canucks ate them all. Now <laughs> no, no. they'll eat anything they can catch, including us. Without the Athorians to maintain the accelerated ecosystem's balance, everything here is falling apart. Mm -hmm. Zerka's killing the restoration project piecemeal. Alright, well, let's get going. That's the plan.
Interesting. Some mercenaries over there. Okay. Beodur has joined our party. He possesses the special ability to rend and destroy force fields. Use the shield breaker ability in combat to disrupt shields. Okay, interesting. Okay, so we need Beodur. Uh, Atten, you're gonna you're gonna stay behind. Uh, we're gonna go with Kreia. Uh, this is what I want. Yep. So we've got Beodur uh, and we've got Kreia. So let's take a look at Beodur here, and let's see what he's got going on. So what is he? Oh, he's pretty light side. That's pretty good. Kray is still in the middle. We're really, actually, really light. It's awesome. All right, let's uh, level him up. So he's a tech specialist. So what does he do? Is he just like a knowledge guy? Uh, repair, security, awareness, demolitions. Yeah, he's got all that stuff. Cool. He has a stealth point. That's funny. Oh my gosh, how many points does he get? Six. Jeez. All right, we'll level him up. Attributes, so his strength is pretty good. His intelligence is good too. Let's level that up. Let's get that bonus there for intelligence. And I get seven points on skills now. So we'll do some treat injury, security, repair, awareness, and computer and demolitions. Wow, his skills are really high. Um, he does get feats, so that's pretty cool. Um, Wow, look at this. He has gear, master gearhead. Um, so I think I'm going to use him as a melee weapons guy. Should I do two weapon fighting or should I do... Hmm. Regenerate vitality points. That's a good one. We'll add that. Okay, so he's level 8. Let's see what he has. He has nothing on him right now, so he needs things. Okay, so let's give him some constitution. Give him an interface band, that'll help his computers and security. Uh, detonator gloves and infiltrator gloves. Yeah, infiltrator gloves, that's going to give him computer and security added. Uh, what can he wear? Light battle armor, that looks like that's probably the best for him. That'll help his defense out a lot. His defense went from 11 to 18, so that's definitely going to be good. Uh, we'll give him uh, some of these random energy shields that we have. Uh, we've been using the energy shields, but not quite enough, I guess. Okay, uh, safety harness, stealth field. Yeah, we'll give him the safety harness. That'll help demolitions. And then exchange negotiator, vibro sword. Uh, I still have the modified holdout blaster. That's funny. Uh, yeah, let's give him the Vibro Sword, and then uh, that'll be uh, good for him there. Let's take a look at Kreia, see if there's anything that we can change on her. Accuracy Gloves, that's cool. Persuade up. Dexterity plus three, let's do that. That's pretty cool. And then she still has this Mining Laser. Is there anything else I can... Benox Blaster. Modified holdout blaster, maybe? Yeah, we'll do that. We'll give her the modified holdout blaster. That'll give her a plus hit bonus. And then let me take a look at myself, make sure I'm in good shape. Um, yeah, that armor's awesome. I still have the Telos mining shield, that's good. Insulated gloves, neural band, lore and implants. Mm, and then my sword. So I've got this fiber blade that gives bonus against droids. And then this one, which is uh, pretty solid, it gives it a good critical chance. So, all right, I think we're in uh, good shape here. Let's uh, take a look around. Okay, that was unnecessary. There's some Canox over here, so let's go ahead and uh, let's fight these guys. Let's see how Beodur does here in combat. Uh, let me go ahead and... What does he have? He is ranged, so, okay, we want him aggressive, good. And then I think we have Kreia on Jedi support. Okay, cool. Awesome. Well, let's fight this Kanak here. And let's go ahead. Let's attack him. All right, so let's go ahead and we'll, we'll attack him. And then we'll see uh, how these guys do. No, they are dirty in there now. Interesting. Okay, so he did a leaping attack. Kreia's getting hit. There we go. Okay, we got him. Okay, so Kreia and Beodur can level up again. Kreia giving us a bunch of good stuff here, burst of speed, all that other stuff. So, all right, do they have any remains? Sometimes they'll have remains, I think, where they have random things like 
that they eat. What's up? All right, there's some mercenaries over there. I'm not really gonna. Oh, interesting. There's mines here. Uh, can we recover it? The mercenaries have at least two hidden caches like this. We should keep our eyes open. Okay, yeah, you got it, man. Let's uh, recover it. I'll recover all these mines, level up everybody. Let's see what's in the hidden caches. Yeah, I like having demolitions uh, as as a high skill for myself. Um, I don't really have skills, <laughs> so having uh, demolitions makes me a little bit more useful, even though I'm pretty strong offensively. Uh, but I'm recovering these mines. I don't know what kind of mines they are, but we will recover them. Let's see what's in the cache. And we get uh, components, credits, bronzium light battle armor. Cool. I'll take that. Uh, what was it? Sonic mines? Frag mines? Looks like average Sonic mines. Okay, cool. Now I could just stun droid and then it'll blow up the mine, but you get more points for recovering it. So, all right, awesome. Let's level up Kraya and let's level up Aoderm. More skills. Okay, computer demolitions, awareness, repair, security, and treat injury. Okay, wow, he has so many skills. He's awesome. Kraya, what can you do? Skills. Uh, let's give you stealth, awareness, repair, and treat injury. She gets feet. Okay, what kind of feet do I want to do for her? Hmm, she doesn't really get a lot of feet. Advanced Jedi defense. Hmm. Dueling, yeah, let's make her dueling. This gives uh, plus three attack and defense. Yeah, let's do that. That's good, because she only has one hand. <laughs> Alright, powers. She gets two force powers, okay. Uh, let's do, I'm thinking battle meditation, we'll do that. And then we'll do an offensive power. Drain life, oh my gosh. Yeah, let's do drain life. Alright, so we got a, uh, a support power and offensive power, which is, which is helpful. So. Alright, let's, uh, let's go fight these mercenaries, mercenaries real quick here. Right where we need to go. That sentry droid probably spotted us already. They were probably looking for me when they saw your shuttle go down. That's all good, man. I got you. All right, let's uh, take a look here. Um, so what I'm thinking we can do, let's go ahead. I'm going to equip this mining shield. Yeah. I'm going to have him equip the energy shield. Where and I'll he? have Kreia equip that. And now let's go... Yeah, guys, sorry. Uh, I will attack him. Oh, this guy's coming at me. Let's attack him. Let's start with him. Let's see how we do here against these guys and enemies. So Kraya, you know, some really good force powers. That's gonna really help us. This guy seems pretty solid. Uh, but we have tons of buffs going right now for Kraya. Should be able to hit him with the blasters. Oh yeah, we're, we're wrecking him now. I'm gonna be deflecting the blasters from them. They're so awesome. Theodore, I think, has got that. So let's get this guy. Let's force whirlwind him and then we'll attack. Nice. Force whirlwind him. Get him up in the air. Finish him off. Finish him off. Nice. Okay. Good stuff. Great job, everybody. Uh, let's hang back for a second here. I think the energy shields were really helpful. My energy shield is gone. Ah, uh, remains. What do you have? A force pike. That might be fun for somebody. This guy's got remains too. Mandalorian melee shield. A land speeder. Ooh, what's in here? Vehicle controls appear to be code lock. You can't use it. Uh, that sucks. And uh, what about swoop pike? Same. Okay. Awesome. All right, well, let's uh, go ahead and go this way. I am going to level myself up, and then I am going to finish. I'm going to save the game. So let me go ahead and level myself up, and I will save the game. So hang on one second here. Let me see. I want to do demolitions. Um, I do get a force power, so let me do something offensive. Uh, I like 
disable droid, that might be helpful. And then accept, and let me go ahead and save. That's where we're going to finish for today. Alright, so that's going to be it for today. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll uh, see you guys next time.